Did you know that astronomers can use their hands, this handy measuring tool, to tell them something about angular diameters of things in the sky? I can show you how to use your handy measuring tool to measure something about the height and the distance of this building behind me. Let's take a look. Anything I can just obscure with my hand outstretched, where the bottom of the object lines up with my little finger and the top of the object lines up with my thumb will be three times further away from me than it is tall. I know this because I'm using a simple ratio. The ratio of the distance from my thumb to my little finger when my hand is outstretched and using that as a height, the distance to my eye. This, what I'm calling a height now, from the tip of my thumb to my little finger when my hand is outstretched has a name in some Spanish-speaking cultures. It's called una cuarta and people use it as a non-standard standard measuring tool. I need to know my ratio of una cuarta or the height of my outstretched hand to my eye. And so I'm going to measure the length of my arm, which is pretty much the distance to my eye, using my outstretched hand. There's one, two, three. When I get to my shoulder, I'm pretty much even with my eye. And so I have shown you that there is a one to three ratio. When the string is outstretched, you can see that I have two similar triangles. One that's formed by the side of the building and going back to my eye, and the embedded similar triangle formed by my cuarta going back to my eye. Because these are similar triangles, that one to three ratio that we measured with my cuarta and the length of my arm is equal to the ratio of the height of my building and my distance to it. What's important in making this measurement is that my elbow remains straight. If I bend my elbow, this is not three distances away from my eye any longer. Elbow has to remain straight and I'm going to face the object that I'm measuring. When I'm solving for an unknown in a proportion, all I need to know is three of the measurements. I know my one to three ratio of my cuarta to the length of my arm, and to measure the height of that building, all I need to know is my distance to it. I measured the distance to the building just now, and it was 7.5 meters. If it's also a one to three ratio, where the height of the building is one third of the distance to it, that means the height of that building is 2.5 meters. I can use that to measure the height of a tree, the height of a door, the height of a window, anything. As long as I know one of those measurements, either its height or its distance, I can find the other one using that proportion.